Good morning, my old school soul food family. Chef Jeffrey back with another video, y'all. It's been a couple of weeks since I did one of these. You know, two weeks ago I was in Vegas on the on the on the Monday to do one for Tuesday, and last week I was in with my mom celebrating her birthday. So Tuesday didn't get no breakfast video, but I'm back on my schedule, y'all. Old school soul food country breakfast segment of the week, y'all. And yes, the video title says it right. We're gonna make some sausage country potatoes, scrambled eggs, all in one skillet. One skillet, y'all. All I'm going to mess up is one skillet. How, how easy is that? Something I learned how to do in college when you only have one skillet. Of course, I have more skillets than I knew to do it now, but I'm going to show y'all an easy way to make a breakfast for your family early in the morning, especially if you don't want to dirty up a lot of pots and pans and stuff. Very simple, very easy. This whole video going to take... Well, real time, it's going to take 30 minutes, but YouTube time, it's going to take about 5, 10 minutes because it's not going to really take that long to do this. I'm going to do some home fried potatoes from scratch as hot links. going to put some hot links in there. going to split them in half, lay them in that skillet, and let them cook off right there. I'm going to put the scrambled eggs right in there, make a little room for them scrambled eggs, and scrambled eggs right in the skillet, y'all. Scrambled eggs, potatoes, and Hot meats. Can't get no better than that, right? And we'll use some, I ain't going to do no business. Give me some regular light bread and eat it with that. And we got a quick, easy breakfast start the week. So anyway, y'all, I'm going to get all set up, get my potatoes chopped up, onions diced up, eggs cracked, sausage cut, split, and we're going to get this breakfast together. Old school soul food, big country, breakfast segment of the week. Just getting started. We'll be right back. Okay, y'all, we are back. I got everything all prepped up here. I got my skillet heating up over here, y'all. And let me show y'all what I got here. I got my potato diced up. Nice, medium dice here. I got some diced onions back here. I cracked my egg. I got four eggs. That's enough to feed a couple of people. Then my hot links. You know the hot links here? All I did, I split them like that. When I put them in the skillet, I'm going to put them down like that in the skillet with my hot links here. And people gonna say, where you get hot links? I get the hot links at ATB, and I'm gonna show you which one I get. Hold on just a second, because everybody gonna be asking. People gonna be asking, where you get the hot links? Where you got? This is the hot links I use. Hill Country Fair. I get them at ATB. I don't know where else you can get them. I get mine at ATB. I don't know. If you can get them online or what. I always buy them at ATB right here in Katy. Now I shop at. They always have been there. They cost $3.99 a box. Yeah. So anyway, y'all, let me move y'all over here to the skillet. And we're gonna start with my potatoes first. And I'm gonna get them all browned off pretty nicely. And after that, I'm gonna add my onions. Because I don't want to add my onions right now. Because the onions gonna burn before the potatoes get ready. So I want to spread these potatoes out as even as possible and let them get a good color. I'm not going to touch them here. I'm going to add a little bit more oil. Not a lot of oil. I don't want a lot of oil in these potatoes because I want them greasy. Just a little oil there to kind of saute them off there. That's it. I'm going to season with salt and pepper on this side. When I flip them over, I'll season the other side. Put a little salt and pepper on them. And that's all I'm going to do, y'all. I'm going to let them sit here and do this about, about five, six minutes. And I'm not going to touch them at all. I want to get a nice color on them, nice brown, crispy color on them, because these potatoes are going to be kind of crispy on the outside and nice and tender and fluffy on the inside. So there's a method to the madness here. And I don't want, like I said, I got onions here. I don't want to just throw the onions in there right now because the onions are going to be totally burnt before the potatoes get ready. Because these potatoes are going to take a minute to cook. So anyway, y'all, I'll be right back once the potatoes are ready to turn over. Be right back. All right, y'all, we are back here. Okay, y'all, now it's time to flip them over here, y'all. Show you the color you got on them. Flip them over as best you can here. And like I was telling y'all, you don't touch them. You want to get a nice color on them. Get as much as you can flip over, because they ain't going to flip over evenly, but you can get the point of what I'm trying to tell y'all. See that nice color on them? 
And these over here. A little bit more here. Look at that, y'all. I'm going to put a little bit more salt and pepper on them. It's going to be nice and seasoned, y'all. Nice little kosher salt and white pepper on there. I'm telling y'all. It's a process of this. You don't want to rush it, but you don't want, like I say, too much oil. See how I just got just enough oil in here to, to saute them. I don't want to deep fry them. I'm not trying to deep fry them. I don't want no greasy potato, home fried potatoes. Even though they're not fried, they like sauteed. Or you can call them cottage potatoes. Also, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to continuously keep turning them every two or three minutes until they get nice golden brown. And then, I'm going to add the onions to them, get the onions in there, get a nice color on the onions. Then we're going to kind of push these to the side of the skillet. We're going to put our hot links in there, get them cooked off, which ain't going to take two or three minutes because they already cooked. I'm just bringing them up to temperature. And I'm going to try to push them in the corner, and I'm going to scramble my egg in there too. Like I say, we're using one skillet to make this breakfast, y'all. You can't go wrong with this. You just put the skillet right in the middle of the table, y'all. Y'all eat right out of the skillet. How country is that? Anyway, y'all, we'll be right back. Okay, y'all, we are back here. Now, let's see that nice color on there. These potatoes are set about three quarters of the way done. Now, we're going to add onions to this, y'all. Put our onions in there. Now, this one I'm going to mix them all together here. Get some onions all mixed in there with the potatoes. Get a nice color on them onions. Now, we're going to add the hot links to this, y'all. Let's see that nice color on them onions. And remember, I got my fire completely hot right now, y'all. Completely hot. And I want to have a nice seal on these potatoes. I don't want them to boil. I want them to be crispy. Now we're going to add, a, like I say, the onions to this. Y'all think I'm going to have enough room in here to make other stuff in this skillet? We about to find out, huh? Like I said, you can feed two or three people with this, y'all. It's in the hot how much they eat. Okay, I'm gonna spread this back out. Let the onions do their thing. Get that nice crispy, uh, let's see here. A nice color on these onions, y'all. Make sure they all mixed up in there good. All right. All right, y'all. I'm going to step off again, be right back. Once I come back, I'm going to move them to the side, and they're going to still continue to cook. I'm going to put my hot links in there. Like I said, I want to do this first. This takes the longest. The hot links and the eggs ain't going to take no more than five to six minutes, y'all, as this cook a little bit more. So anyway, y'all, we'll be right back. Okay, y'all, we back. Okay, now I'm going to put a little of my shake in there. It's going to give it a nice little color and a little bit more flavor. Old school shake there. Move them around there. Give them a little toss. Okay. Now, I'm going to push these to the side. Get them all in that little corner over there. We're going to pile them up over in that corner there, y'all. Get over in that corner. There we go. Give me some room there. Now we're going to throw our hot links in here. Give them a hot links cooking. Look at that. Some hot links cooking right there. Put just a little oil on it. Not much. Like I said, y'all, I don't want this to be no greasy, greasy breakfast. Put a little oil on there. Just a little. And the potatoes are going to continuously cook to the side, but they're not going to overcook. See that? All one pot meal here. One skillet meal here. So I'm going to get a nice little sear on this sausage. In the meantime, y'all, on the other side here, I got my eggs here. Y'all remember my eggs? I'm going to put a little salt and pepper. I like to season my eggs. I'm going to put a little salt and pepper in them. I'm just going to kind of get the fork here. And they scramble. So all I'm going to do is go and get them mixed up there in the bowl. So when I put them in the skillet, they good to go. Like I say, y'all, see how quick this breakfast coming together? Very quick, very easy. This is how you cook for people last minute, like, oh, I don't know what I'm... Yeah, we're going to eat a country breakfast here. 
Y'all ever at my house sometimes, <laughs> say I've got breakfast over, my neighbors make sure they are not late. If you're late, you're gonna miss out. So there y'all be back in just a second here. When it's time to flip this over, this breakfast almost finished, y'all. Be right back. All right, y'all, we back. Okay, y'all, now we're gonna turn our sausage over here, our hot links. Like I say, these hot links ain't gonna take long. All you're doing is warming them up. They already cooked. You just wanna get a good sear on them. See yeah. that? See that, y'all? Get a good sear on them. And the potatoes doing good back here. See, they all piled up in there. Look at that potatoes, y'all. I'm telling y'all. It's an easy breakfast, y'all. Easy breakfast. Now, what I'm going to do here, I know the sausage is pretty much ready, hot links. What I'm going to do, y'all, I'm going to pile them right up here on the side here. Remember, everything is still cooking, so it's all good. Now, here go the eggs here. Try to get all that little color out of the way here. Well, we put the eggs right in here, y'all. Give me a little room for the eggs. Move that up in there. Y'all get up in there. All them nice potatoes out the way. Now. Y'all with me now? Y'all ain't sleep, huh? You can't be sleep. It's breakfast time. But just a little oil in there. Not much, y'all. Just a little oil. Now we're going to put these eggs right in here, y'all. Look at this. Put these eggs right in here. Right in there, come in. Come in, y'all. Some potatoes get in there, that's fine, y'all. Scramble them things right in there. Come in, come in, come in. There we go. There we go. If some potatoes get in the eggs, that's fine. You eating them with the potatoes anyway, y'all, right? Right? Come here, come here. Get up on them sausages. Come on, come on. All right, look at that. Look at that, y'all. Look at that here. Now I'm gonna turn this off and let it go. Ooh, potatoes get in them eggs, it's okay. Don't worry. That's it, y'all. I'm turning this off. Move this over a little. We got them sausages laid back down in there. Look at that. One skillet meal. How's that, y'all? Look at that. You hate that at the table, huh? Just put the whole skillet on the table, right? Anyway, y'all, I'm going to step out, do that famous Wuchu thumbnail, and we're going to come back and eat, y'all. Old school soul food, big country breakfast of the week. Almost finished. Be right back. All right, y'all, we are back here. Look at this, y'all. Let me move this over here just a second. Look at this. Look at that breakfast. Now that's restaurant style breakfast. It don't cost you much at all, y'all. You got your cottage potatoes on there with your onions and potatoes, scarf scrambled eggs, and your hot links there. Like I said, I'm gonna eat it with some light bread here, but I'm gonna give a taste test here. Y'all don't judge me. I like hot sauce on my eggs, y'all. Y'all don't judge me here. A little hot sauce on my eggs. And I gotta got to put some ketchup on my potatoes. Put a little right there. Sometimes I put ketchup on my hot links. Okay, let's try these potatoes out. Potatoes are perfectly cooked. Perfectly cooked. Look at this, y'all. Look at that. Mm. Perfectly seasoned. Mm. Seasoned to perfection. Soft scrambled egg. A little potato on there with that egg. We ate nice and soft scrambled, not overcooked. And let me eat hot link, y'all. Mm, mm, mm. You got the red pepper flakes in there. See the red pepper? It's nothing good. They're not overly hot. Mm. We could say hot link. Mm -mm. I don't like spicy food. You just got enough heat to it. Hit you in the back of your throat. For breakfast here, y'all. It's for breakfast here. Mm. 
Like I say, I don't even make biscuits with you. What are you? Give me some Wonder Bread. With there. Put that Wonder Bread, put that, what I do, put that egg and cream of Wonder Bread with some potatoes. Make you fold over. Hmm. Y'all don't know, man. Y'all don't know. Like I said, when I tell my neighbors and friends or whatever, I'm doing breakfast this weekend. Can you believe nobody's late? I can tell them be here at 5 in the morning. They'll be ringing the doorbell at 4.30. But they know. When I'm going to do a breakfast, I'm going to do a breakfast. <laughs> wow. Anyway, y'all. Little short video here. Show you how quick it is. To make breakfast. And what all I messed up. One skillet. It's the way you cook it. How organized you are. Anything can be done. You see, I did the potatoes first, then threw the onions in there, put the hot links in there, which didn't take long. They already cooked. You just want to bring them up to temperature and throw your eggs in there while you got a breakfast. Unless it really, in real time, if I have to uh, measure everything out, it would took me 10 minutes, real time, to do this breakfast. Exactly. But anyway, y'all, let me close this video out. If you like this video, Please share, please comment, please subscribe, please follow my other social media accounts. Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, Twitch TV, Pinterest. Y'all watch me on TikTok. I'm going live on TikTok a lot. So if you ain't got a TikTok account, get you a TikTok account and follow me on TikTok. Right now, I'm just posting food, just warming up. But later, I'm going to be doing all kinds of crazy stuff you never see me do. Y'all don't see me on camera a lot. You'll see me on camera on TikTok trying to dance, workout video, me trying to get on the treadmill, trying not to get it too fast. Crazy stuff. Follow me on TikTok, I'm telling you. In the next couple of months, you're gonna wish you have. Y'all gonna see the side. You know I'm already, that people say, oh, you're crazy, you're funny. That's just me. But when I'm in my element, especially with my friends, and we're doing videos and stuff like that, I'm not Chef Jeffrey. I'm just Wayne, I'm just Jeffrey to people. That's when I have my most, most, most fun. I'm just out of my element having fun. So y'all follow me on TikTok. It's about to really get crazy on that. So anyway, y'all, uh, until next time, have a blessed old school soul food day. And I will see y'all in the next video. And y'all have a happy, happy, blessed week. It's gonna be, the video coming tomorrow, y'all, you're going to absolutely love it. I'm headed to a small town. I ain't going to tell you. But you don't want to miss this road trip I'm going to do uh, for tomorrow video. Hopefully, I get it up tomorrow. I'm doing a road trip, small town, cafe. I haven't ever been. Heard so much about it. Make sure you don't miss tomorrow's video. Love y'all, bro. Love y'all. See, I forgot what I was saying. See, I keep interrupting myself. I need to close the video out. My team ain't here to stop me. I can talk all I want. But anyway, love y'all. Bye.